everybody, this is Chris, your dependable host for all things Read. And as your dependable host, whenever there's a new tool, I gotta find out about it, right? Well, the good news is we have Nick here from Read to explain exactly what this is in front of us. Nick, how are you today? Pretty good, how about you? I'm great, thanks for joining us. Mm -hmm. So uh, explain what this is. Well, this is a new PE squeeze tool. PE squeeze tool. You know, I seem to remember a Q&A that you and I did in the past yep. about another squeeze tool. Is this related in some way? It is. What you're referring to is the bear hug. It's actually right behind us. It's hydraulically driven. This is driven manually with an acne screw. So they, they are similar, but this one is different. And uh, what diameter pipe are we talking for this one? The capacity for this tool is two to four inch pipe. Okay, so it is available for much smaller jobs. Yes, yes. The bear hug was a three to eight inch pipe capacity. Okay, so that was a bear hug and this is a cub hug? Anyway, in all seriousness, it's called the PES4DB, right? Mm -hmm. What does the DB stand for? Well, the DB stands for double bar. The double bar is right here on the bottom bar and the top bar. It's the part of the bar that's in contact with the pipe. Now, this geometry, it creates better flow control when the squeeze-off is completed. All right, so are there any other features that you want to talk about today with this tool? Well, with the new design of this tool, we incorporated a ball bearing and an O-ring inside this thrust component right here underneath the Acme screw. The ball bearing makes it easier to squeeze, and the O-ring keeps contaminants from getting into the ball bearing. So this actually makes it 30% easier on the operator to squeeze. So you have one more feature to show us? No, two. There's two more? Yes. Wow, this is crazy. I can't handle all this. Go I ahead, know, but go first ahead. we gotta take the pipe out. Oh, all right. all right. So right here we have actually the ASTM standards posted right on the tool for feed and release rate. And also, hey, if you could hold it right here. Mm -hmm. We incorporated these machine grooves on the bottom bar. It, it eases with lifting while it's in the ditch. You can see here, it's all, it makes it a lot easier than trying to get your fingers under there, right next to the rock and gravel. Huh. Now, how heavy is this? It's approximately 35 pounds. Okay, so it's rather light. Well, Nick, this is absolutely wonderful. Thank you for showing us the PES4 DB. You're the best dependable host Reed has. Oh, shucks. Well, make sure you visit www.readmfgco.com and get yours today.